Hello, everybody, and welcome to Let's Try. My name is Retromation. This is Schism, a bullet hell action RPG roguelike that I'm excited to be checking out the demo for here today. I haven't heard anybody talking about it, but it looks quite good. So in we're going to go to see what it's all about. I did do the tutorial already, and I'll go over the basics of it right now. More or less, we've got, you know, move and shoot, but we also have the ability to transform between two different phase shifts here either red or blue when we're in the blue mode we can avoid blue bullets when we're in the red mode we can avoid red bullets so we've got that we've got you know experience all that kind of jazz uh but as far as what the rest of this stuff is i don't know yet i just did the tutorial what do, what do you got hello hey you want to get flipping ripped <laughs> i mean okay so we don't have the stuff for that get out of here this ain't free okay Let's get uh, down in here, start a new run. Okay, so we have got a map here. I don't know what these different rooms are. That was not in the tutorial here. So we are, everything is going to be like truly figuring it out for the first time. I don't know if that's going to be a boss or an item. I guess let's find out. It's an item. Because yeah, in Binding of Isaac, a crown is an item. Even though you would say like, hey, maybe the king, boss. Quetzal Fang, plus five poison, and then pick one. Okay, so we have plus five poison. All right, Stinger. Seeking. Fire three bullets that converge at the cursor. Mod has bonus bleed damage. B bullets boosted by intelligence. Sure. Okay. All right, I'm going to assume that those are going to go around and home in on enemies. This is going to be, what, like a cursed room of some kind? Another life, another tomorrow. Some of your experience gained is lost. Gain faith per experience loss. Every three favor gives you a free revive. So there's kind of like a, um, a god's system where these are sort of like quests, and if you complete them, you get items and relics based off of them. Deal extra damage, but most rooms will always have waves of enemies. Most rooms always have waves of enemies. Kill for faith. Uh, gain HP and attack. Spawn more champions. Gain faith per champion kill. Favor boost attack, HP, and enemy numbers. Sure. We'll do that. You find a device with three buttons with labels on it. Which do you press? Gain two to four random hearts. Three to six combinations of card keys and bombs. Or get some money. I guess I'll get keys and bombs. The machine evaporates into useful tools. Okay. So these are definitely going to be enemy rooms. Press F to unfreeze. We also have what do what we got here? Weaken side. It's an active. Chooses target closest to mouse. Target takes bonus damage and deals less damage. Gotcha. So we can do that even before the room starts. That's kind of cool. All right. So what are, we're in blue mode, now we're in red mode. You can kind of see that around the corners here. And it's going to be indicated on the bullets. Oh, you, you there, dude? Switch to blue. I think I took uh, some damage from some ground spikes. Oh my word, there is a lot to manage. All right. Hello there, sir. That's it? That's all. Okay, good. How do I feel about this, uh, the B gun? I guess it's not bad. Out we go. So it takes 20 mana to use this. Is that an enemy? Probably is, unfortunately. Okay, just keep a, keep an eye out. I'm seeing we got some scattered bullets kind of in the corners here. Swap the red, I suppose. When I see the red border on the outside, I'm like, oh no, I just took damage. But no, nah, it's just, I'm in, in red mode. The <laughs> sound effects and stuff, man. <laughs> One sec. We will we'll turn those down after the room. The heck. Okay. So we got triple enemy room over here. I don't know if it's a wave room or an elite room. We're leveling up. Gain HP and attack. Spawns more champions. Gain faith for every champion kill. So faith is how we're going to like level up and eventually get some fancy... Fancy, fancy upgrades. Okay, so that guy takes more, deals less. Get out of here, punk. Ooh. 
So we can absorb those just by switching to the right color and walking into them as well. So that's good to know also. You can just walk through some. Boop, 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 boop. All right. Another wave here. It Did I level up or I got like a faith level up, I think. Yeah, faith level. We got a, a level up. So we're going to need to find, I think, kind of like an experience shrine in order to actually get... Oh, level up stairs. This is crazy. Okay, there's a bat down there that was just kind of vibing. Okay, so that one is not one that goes away when we run into it. Go bees, go. Go bees, go. Back it up, back it up, back it up. So we got some poison. F to unfreeze time once more. I mean, hey, looks like it's probably going to be the last one. Oh! Red, blue. Probably should get rid of that guy. He's definitely the, uh, the harder of these punks. Get rid of those by walking into them. This is neat. It's taking a lot of brain power, I'll say that's for sure. Oh, gain max health. So yeah, we leveled up. Gain max health, gain attack. Attack speed, speed, evasion. Max mana, better items. I mean, somebody... Maximum bomb, regen, luck, crit, evasion, crit, max energy, RNG. Gain faith experience faster. So it looks like there's no way to get intelligence here, right? Oh, or no, okay. Int as the, the stat in general, for some reason. So better item effects. Um... So if this, the B gun scales, yeah, the innate passive of this is that it scales on int. I'll say sure. Yeah. I'll just upgrade the B gun. We have a key. So this is a shop. How much money do we have? One? I'm going to take a wild crack and say that one is not a lot of money. Okay. I do like that we get a kind of pick where we want to start. That's a really neat quality of life thing. Okay, we can just walk through all the red. Oh! Get out, get out, get out. That's the thing. It's, it's interesting. There's lots of bullets on the screen, but if you're the same color as one of them, it just doesn't matter if you get hit by them. Like, I've been technically hit by lots of bullets, but they... I'm at 78 out of 72 HP. More intelligence? Better item effects? Uh, I mean, I can also just gain some attack. Eh. I'll go for intelligence. The smartest of boys. Still only have the one coin. I don't know if I want to waste my key on that. Man, the, the sound effect balance and, and like music stuff, it's so ominous. Which I think is on purpose. So let's go ahead and mark that guy. Okay. B-Gun seems to be doing some pretty darn good damage now. Get him, B-Boys. Walk into that one. Can walk into a couple of those. Man, it's, it's risky doing that, but it's kind of fun, I will say. Chest. This one is free, it looks like. Three coins and a key. Use a bomb to open. Oh god, what was it? Q, I think? Use bomb to open. F to interact. So we have bombs kind of like um, Razor Nova. Flicked all enemies in the room with bleed. So that's a special one-time use. This looks like a little heal. You find a game shop, Vendobot, with working card vending features. Oops. <laughs> I, Okay, I'm surprised I can use that. Well, there's a dialogue box up. Uh, health potion, enemies in the room deal half damage, charms one to three random enemies for a duration. Age of choice. Alright, we got a mass weakened card, and there is definitely gonna be that. Okay, so now that we have six coins, I don't know, I feel like it might be sort of like Isaac levels, where, you know, it doesn't take a whole lot to buy some stuff. But even with that in mind, six would be low, if we're going for Isaac economy which this game seems to be definitely taking, you know, some inspiration from. Five, okay. Two, five, five, three. I'm assuming these are for these. Fifteen for 
suppressor attack scaling five attack speed reduced cool stuff i mean we can't get any of this right now 10 shield bomb trade five hp for a coin Ooh. well for one coin it's not gonna really be that good of a trade i like it when games give you that option i'll be wild let's get some shield and by wild i mean boring and safe so we can actually um, teleport between rooms. Makes backtracking a lot less annoying. Is Fly, Cl Fly Queen clearly going to be a boss we can mark it, though. How long does that last? I don't know. It might be forever. If that's true, that's like... Oh, int boost duration. I don't think it's forever. Cool. I'll mark you again, just in case. Get ready for the blue switch. This is neat. I will say so far, this boss is a lot easier than um, just the standard enemies until you switch and jebate me. Okay, you swapped and jebated me. You've done it. Congratulations. You did the thing that I said. Oh, the timing on that was very tight. Okay, yep, 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 yep. You've gotten kind of nasty with it. Congratulations. You've done me dirty. Okay, so we got a bunch of these flies to deal with. Enemy B. Uh, maximum intelligence? Giga brain build? So this is a free chest. We get some coins. We're up to four again. Key to interact. Uh, I have four keys. Sure. Got some mana back. Got a mana potion item. G to swap. Oop. Down we go. This is neat. Hey, how you doing, man? Uh... Good? Well, I'm glad to hear that. Stay safe out there, kid. Oh. What should I have said bad so that you give me pity? Find an altar to chaos. Be careful. Reroll all items into one item. I don't think... I don't know if I have any items. I, unless my... You know, these count. I think it's talking... I thought it was talking about, like, passives and stuff. Rubble collapses and traps you in the room. What do you do? Use faith and pray to your god. 20% chance. Accuracy to look for an exit. Strength to punch the rocks. Chris Redfield style. Just go for the highest chance. Your sharp vision spots an exit. No way. Okay, so this was a random room. I guess that the randomness just can also be enemies. Um. Okay. Back it up, back it up. Back it up, back it up, back it up. We got a lot of blue coming there, so we're just fine to stay blue. Are the bees, like, not homing in and catching up to him enough? Or is he just, like... I think he's just a very tanky lad. Ow. Okay. Oh, you. You are the man who stinks. My bees, like, starting to not be good anymore? Or is that supposed to be... Maybe that was just a tougher room? Um... That, yeah, I was gonna say, I don't know that I could block all those bullets while I was standing right there. Yeah, see, like... Though, it's weird. I don't move that fast, so it's kind of like... Some of those bullets are just gonna hit me sometimes, it seems like. Unless I can move a little bit faster, is there something I'm missing? Another key? Sure. Another mass weaken? Or or what? Unknown memory. See what it... Use to see what it does. Faith up. Cool. Got health. Looks like there is... I'm assuming that's going to be a champion. I don't know why. I don't feel good about that. <laughs> I don't know anything about the, you know, the enemies yet, but like, I don't like the look of that. I think, I just don't like the, the frequency, like how many enemies there are. Can we do an easier one first? This one looks, I mean, but maybe there's, maybe they're tougher enemies, but there's less of them. Okay, so there's a man on the wall. Oh. Back it up, back it up, back it up. Yep. The swapping, constant swapping between guys are truly brutal. 
Get him. How much damage we do that? 27. So we're doing roughly as much... The same damage, actually, with the bees. I guess the benefit is just that they're homing. I'll say a fun fact about the game uh, as well. I'm not using it because I just don't think it's worth the mana right now. I'm trying to home through the wall. But you can double tap reload to force reload immediately. It just costs 10 mana. Unknown memory. I have a feeling... Active mass confusion. Okay, didn't help. I am hurting. So I could use mass weaken in that, like, big elite room, I guess. That could be a good call. Let's get the healing. And what was the other one? The mana. You know what? Yeah, I'll just, I'll, I'll pop that one. Face stealer. Okay, so he should be doing half damage. Okay. Kind of want to... My bees don't go very far. I feel like I'm going to need to get these guys out of here. Otherwise, we're going to have some uh, some overlapping that I can't deal with. Like, like that was some garbage. Yeah, I think I'm... I think I'm toast, man. So those do look like they at least explode eventually. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is disgusting. I did that exact backwards, but it's kind of like, what are you going to do? I feel like I'm doing no damage. The bees scale their damage on intelligence. I was hoping that it was going to scale a little bit harder, I guess. Uh. <laughs> oh, Nelly, Nelly, Nelly. We're getting there. We're getting there. He's such a tanky guy. Okay. Almost done. Almost done with the face stealer. Don't. 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 Okay. I have one health. I have one health. I have one health. Uh, is this regen? Is REG regen? How much mana you regen? Yeah, it is regen, but it's not health regen. I'll say good. Like I, as much as I wish I had regen right now. Okay. Cost ten HP to open. Oh no. Oh, that was the boss. Okay. Good. That that I'm glad that was the boss. So what is a champion? Or the like what what is a champion then? What am I Oh god. There's something special up there, but this room looks so crowded. Oh well. Let's let's die. Let's die. A big boy. Oh my god, the floor spikes got me good. Brutal stuff. Ah! It's just like uh, having to dodge all the different multicolor bullets and dealing with this stuff and dealing with the spikes. Woo! Ow. Okay, we could get more attack speed, speed, and evasion. Honestly, I think that would help. Oh, surely it didn't speed me up, like, that much. Surely that's, like, some out-of-combat movement stuff. Uh, ooh! Four attacks, re refund AP. So that is, um, that gets... Let's put on everything. F to interact. I mean, I'll give it a look. Hello. Howdy, partner. Looking to improve your weapon? Boost a random stat. Get another mod? Boost a stat. Mm. Range. That sounds nice. 
I kind of, I don't know. I, should I have done it a different way? Probably, but I really like that this is a thing. So we buffed this up so that four attacks, every four attacks we refund an AP, I guess. Gotcha. What's your deal? What do you seek? Uh, uh, Reroll gun mods. Plus five max shield. I feel like I could probably reroll that. Crits give you two mana. I don't know how often I'll crit. That's probably based off of... Nope. It's, it's a whole different thing. All right. Well, I spent a lot for that. And then you're down here too? Scrap gun for money. No. I can scrap this for three bucks. Actually fine, yeah. It has nothing going on for it, so sure. We'll do that, and then I'll... I can't do anything here, right? These were, these were five. Reforge the gun's stats. Range and AP. I feel like... I'm happy to re reforge those. Crits now give six. Oh, that can actually go down to the mod, too? So speed went up by a whole bunch. Gotcha. And it, is this... Wait, is this RNG? or I'm assuming this was range. But art down here... Yeah, okay, okay. It is range. Okay. 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 Things just got a little bit better there for this weapon. Am I going to instant die? Maybe. We saw instant die a little bit stronger. Okay. Yeah, definitely, I'm a lot stronger. I don't know if it's going to be enough to save me right here. There's a lot going on. Okay. Ah, you jerk. All right, at least there's no, um... Okay, so these guys are flying around invincible. Are they just support units, then? Is that the idea? Maybe. Or maybe they can just go invincible? That man. That man up there needs to die. You there. Now maybe we can get him? Yes, we can. Good. Yeah, this weapon got a lot better. Like, a lot better. I am dying, and uh, about to die, but whatever. It seems like it's a very tough game, so I'm not, I'm not upset by that. So what was, we don't, we only have two bucks. Let's go die in this room. Or live. Yeah, no, we're dead. That's an immediate... That's like, we were completely um, cramped in there. This game is disgustingly brutal, uh, to say the least. But it's also like so snappy that it's hard to be mad at that. Most points, 41. What do we got here? What is this? Not enough points. Okay, don't know what that's about. Don't know what that's about. Don't know what that's about. We have 40 coins. We can start something with uh, get a one coin. I mean, it's not not a lot of stuff. There. Look at that. Converted. Meta progress. We have two coins for this run. Jingly keys. Keys held give a flat luck bonus. Leaf Blower, minus 30 accuracy, plus 3 bullets. Innate mod, 6 HP regen. Bullets explode, bullets fall in mass, bullets chase enemies, extra crit. I gotta admit, the thought of a flamethrower just sounded fun. Okay, so this is the god room. Take more damage, but instantly gain 50% more HP and bleed chance. Gain faith per missing HP and MP or from bleed damage. Favor gives you more bleed damage and HP. Convert half of all HP into armor and gain damage reduction. Losing all armor puts regen on cooldown. Gain faith and experience for mitigated damage or from current armor. Hot. 
Choose a god to worship. Get two zombie familiars, but lose speed. Pilgrim. Gain extra keys and bombs. Faith and stuff. This is really, this is such a neat system. Kill for faith. I feel like... I feel like because I didn't pick the altar, like I'm down a level or something is kind of the, the catch. I understand that we made things well. Oh, we got, a, we got this. Active. Fire. Launch a fireball that explodes at the end. Okay, this thing seems seems nuts. I don't I don't know, man. This this seems like a lot better than the bees already. That's the fireball? Oh, the plus 3 bullets actually adds to my fireballs? It doesn't say it fires 3 fireballs, so sound on this. I do love that we don't have to worry about like ammo capacity or anything. That is really helpful at the very least. Cool. You weren't kidding about uh, these rooms having more. Okay. Watch out for the green spike. The green spikes are so tiny. Green is unavoidable damage. Okay, so I've leveled theoretically. Why do these, uh, these rooms feel a lot easier than the first rooms of the other one? I don't know what that's about. Okay, so this is just a standard damage. I mean, if we could just go for more damage, I guess. Attack speed, speed, innovation. I actually really like that. Like, not that we need to be attacking faster with this one, but I like the speed. As a way, because since there's no dodge, yes, there is the, uh, the thing is you're supposed to flip between the two things. Not enough energy. Get back, get back, get back, you! I know that's supposed to be kind of like in place of the dodge. That's your verb of the game, more or less. Uh-oh. Kill that man. He just, he just showed up showed up and died. Hello. Goodbye. Unfreeze time. I mean, we better be getting like a lot more experience or something at the very least, right? Alright, we got red bat, blue bat. Mostly blue bats, so I guess I'll be blue. Okay. Oh god, that's still here. No, not a man. I do like the fireball. The use case for it, very obvious exactly when to use it. Had a hard time figuring out when I wanted to target stuff. Otherwise, okay, I'll go for a little bit of strength now. Shop, we have three bucks. We now know that the intervals of imports are more like five and 15. Can't believe how crazy this weapon is. So I can't believe how freaking slow I am at a base. This is with the, the one movement speed up. Just keep firing. We don't have to worry about ammo. Welcome to hell, goodbye. Good swapping. Good swapping. The multitasking is real, man. Oh, no. Hello there, goodbye. <laughs> Getting those guys immediately is really helpful. The thing I don't like about the leaf blower is just the extreme knockback. I don't think there's anything we can do about that. Crit, max energy, RNG will be range, luck, crit, and evasion. Max mana, better item effects. Yeah, I'll go with attack speed, speed, and evasion. I think, I think that sounds nice. Two chests. God, it's unreal how much better this weapon feels. Cards, keys, bombs, three to six coins. You know what? Give me some coins. Did I just get one? No, oh, I have 16, holy. More money? Let's farm. I kind of want to go, like, save it for the, um, that weapon shop, though. That thing seemed cracked. Because this is locked, yeah? It's locked. I'd, I'd have to spend a key. It's probably worth it for what it's worth. If I can get these ugh, stinkers into a corner, like, 
they are gonna have a bad time. Yep, 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 goodbye. Do I just have like a crazy good mod for this weapon or something? Like what? I don't understand how it's allowed. Innate's minus accurate plus three bullets. That sounds like it's probably what this weapon just has. Oh, hello. I mean, yeah, let's, uh, let's do a little bit of comparison for a second. So, lesson learned, my last... The B weapon is god-awful trash. This weapon is absolute stellar godlike. What the hell? Yeah, I'll spend some health for that, sure. Slay more. Uh, innate mods, crits give two mana, so that's a passive that applies even on this weapon. Get a little bit of that. Um, I have four keys. I'll take a look at the shop. I'm just so used to having to walk it. When I see a... Well, why do that, though? <laughs> that's uh, this mean... Gain attack per level can carry multiple. Crits increase bomb counter, mass confusion, active. Trade three bucks for a chest. Sure. It wasn't worth it. If I was missing health, then yes. Sure, I'll gain attack per level. Sure, sure, sure. And we'll save the rest and we'll move on. Zoop. Away we go. Now much, much stronger than man with stinky bee gun. 3D printer with an item in the display. Uh, gain a random stat up can carry multiple. Seven for the item. Use int to rig it for a copy with a 10% chance. Give it an item for a free item. I'll pay $7 for a random stat, sure. What do we get? Faith. Okay, we're at level two on that. This one is like an easy god to level up at the very least. Oh, boy. What do we got here? I do not know these enemies. The good news is I don't have to because they are dead and dying. Boo. Boo. Okay, this thing. I don't know. If, can this guy die? I don't know if that guy can die. Gah! Rude. You just jiggled right into me. Okay. I do love that the extra bullet seems to apply to the fireball. Like, that's a thing I really enjoy in games. If, like, you know, multi-interactions between, like, weapon spells, things like that, effects applying across the board to certain things, I do really enjoy. If a man's in the corner, they are not going to be there for long. Okay. You back it up. You back it up. You got some blue energy there. Back him up. Back him up. What is happening even? I don't know what we've got going on, but I am a scared. Nice try shooting the red bullet at me, chump. I don't... I feel like I'm supposed to get to, get to the urn to kill these guys, but it's just, like, so... So messy to get there. Okay. We did it. And this one's orange. I don't know if that's something, if that's, like, a champion or, or what. Oh my god. It's quite the wave there. Blast them while they're all clumped up. Nice. That was that was beautiful. More damage, seeing as they are starting to get a lot tankier. How many keys do we have? We have two keys. Bomb to open. Sure. Oh, we had a secret room. Didn't know it was one of those. Found an old machine with healing serum. Uh, three for a heart. Use intelligence to rig it for shields. Hope luck 
Okay, hope luck gives you free stuff. 35% chance. Smash the machine, and it still works. Criminal. Okay, wanted giving a 20% chance to spawn a cop for one floor. Uh oh. I didn't even need it. I was just kind of curious. It was a for science thing, but now I'm wanted. A traveling merchant approaches you and offers you his wares. Neat. You have one ware. 10% attack speed, or 10 attack speed every non-crit gives you a bonus until you crit. Bonus goes with... I mean, that's pretty cool. Shop. I don't have that much money anymore. I do kind of want to use the uh, the blank bombs at some point here. Are you invincible as well? Nope. Definitely not. Okay, that... That thing sucks. We gotta get rid of the weird wizard who makes physics funky. This urn is definitely messed up as well. My god, the knockback is out of control on our stuff. Oh! I didn't know you were a guy. I didn't know you were a guy. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and use the, yeah, the clear bomb because this is getting absolutely wild. What? Okay, so there's my favor from the god that I got. Slash machine, machete, 5% <laughs> crit, 50% crit damage, intelligence increases crit damage. So that's for getting my god's favor, war's favor, up to level 3. Favor gives you power, and extra enemy waves for every two favor. Kill for faith, deal extra damage, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, I lost a bunch of health there, and I now have reason to actually grab some of this stuff. Oh, hello? <laughs> okay. Gray value is the minimum number of keys given on a new floor. Gotcha. All right. Determines reward points on room clear. Three based on time. One based on not getting hit. Ten gives guaranteed chess. Oh, I didn't realize there was some kind of like a timer going on there. As well. Sort. Oh, no. I do not like... I do not like when the physics gets all jiggly up in here. We gotta get down to that urn. Okay, level up. We don't get a level up yet, though. When somebody can die, they die immediately. I guess these, yeah, these orange ones must be the champions that it was talking about. Mm. More damage. More damage funny. We should probably get some max HP, right? Like, it looks like it gave us, like... Doesn't it give us, like, 50? Something crazy like that? Pretty sure. Oh, we can get more? Should I have? Probably not. Accuracy up. Is an accuracy up good for us? I, I would say yes. There's sometimes an argument for not getting accuracy up on spread weapons. I don't think that this is that that day. <laughs> Fireball blast. Get out of here. I hate the uh, invincible guy kind of like chilling on the wall right there. Man asks if you like to fight foes he captured for a reward. Sure. Man throws you some chests and releases the enemies. Oh, God. Pressing F to open that up. Release the enemies. Oh no, I might die. I might die here. Okay, the amount of enemies you captured is very high, my guy. Oh. Yeah, no, this is not good. Yeah, no, this is not good. I want to get that urn. Oh boy. Come back here. At least that chest had a little bit of health in it. It kind of helps. You sure get out of here? Whew. Pain. Terrifying. Lots of money, though. I'm farming. Okay, so that's the uh, the guy who's normally, like, purple. He's wild. Okay. The wizard sucks as well. He messes with physics a bit. And this guy's just invincible. He's just here until the room ends. 
Yep. Giga kill build. It, it seems to let me get very strong in this way, which I do, I do very much enjoy. Where's your urns, sirs? Uh. Oh no. Oh no. The sound. What is happening in there? Um. Um. I don't like that. Well, he's dead now, so we're all good. But <laughs> what the hell? All right. Okay. I'll get some health. Okay, it's 25, which is a lot for what it's worth. The item room. Pick one, pick one. Uh, mods plus five crit. Luck-based chance to create a B on hit. So this is a worse version of this gun, but if I'm just using it to... have the mod, basically... Oh god, the range on that is so bad. Gain many bonus random stats, intelligence boosts the amounts, then all stats become randomized. I don't know about that. Tarot, create a random card. Yeah, probably. Boost attack for this room, intelligence increases the rate. Okay. No, this sounds funnier. So... We can what, pick a new god? What do you ask of this holy machine? Find a new god, heresy, good health, power. Pray and gain faith. Pray for power. Oh, it's a level. Oh, cool. Okay. Let's just grab another HP up. We'll, we'll be a little bit safe with it for a second then. We went uh, we went wild with it. Do it. Stay blue. Stay blue. Gotta find that man's urn. How do I get... Oh, he doesn't have an urn. He just has a lot of... Oh, he does have an urn. He lied. He lied. I think it just takes a little bit for his urn to spawn, I guess, is what it is. Good God, I'm a disgustingly strong. Oh, getting to that urn looks... Uh, annoying? It always, like, looks annoying until... Until you can just, like, you're like... Oh, yeah, I guess I can just randomly walk through. I don't have any keys for that, and I do think that's the gun upgrade, but I also don't have that much money. Okay, we are in red mode. We're fine. Get that urn out of here. Man, this god that makes all these rooms have a million waves probably increases the run length by about three times. Did I spawn a cop or what? I do not have a key. Yet another one. Okay, that guy's... That guy's bonkers. He needs to go first. Purple man goes first all the time. New rule. If purple man's there, he's got to go. Orange is definitely higher health. <laughs> okay. Goodbye. Zoop. 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 There's the printer. We could get... We could pay for more random stats. Should we desire. Tax speed every now. I mean, we could also get this, right? How much do we have? No, we're one off. You jerk. I mean, maybe we could kill the boss and then come back. I don't know if I care or want to. Is this right click for this? Cool. Yeah, I think I made a strong build. Uh. Faith up. No keys. We did get them. We did get the money. So I'll, you know, I'll run and get that item. God. Cool. <laughs> so that's always how it goes. E or F interact. It's I always default to thinking E, but E is use a card in this game. Oh my god. Oof. This is a very tight corridor for this game in a way that 
feels a little awful here. Okay, also green background plus spike floor. Also a little bit spooky. Yeah, I'll pay the hell for that. Sure. This is a bomb to open. Sure. We're in a jungle. Ooh. Man got tricky there. He shoots both styles. Oh, he can't. Okay. Is that a Korok? Like, like, literally, was that like a Korok? Oh, God, the flashing effect there. Not a fan. Nope. Oh. Did that backwards? Okay, these, yeah, these leaves. Genuinely, that guy does look like a Korok. I think that's maybe the, the point. More damage. All strength. Big number funny. I don't need to wait for the next wave. Now. Yeah, not, I do not like that strobe effect. I don't think it's a good idea. Especially because I did turn off flashing lights. As a setting already. Like, which... I know it's not fully the same there, but... I know it's not what it means, but still does visually bother me a bit. So, wait, we can always get a level? Is that what that is? So it, like, automatically puts you to the next level. Interesting. More, more attack speed and evasion stuff. I'm gonna keep the other key. <laughs> Out of combat, I'm so fast. Smash the machine still works. Ah, it's fine. Oh, wait. It, it didn't work, but it gave me the sh shield? So it works to get the shield. It just doesn't... You can't use it again after. Yeah, I feel like I'm... I've got the game on farm here. Oh, boy. I may need to... I'm not kidding. I may need to stop playing. Uh, this strobing effect is actually upsetting my eyes, unfortunately. Uh, so, yeah, it's, it's, we'll try and maybe we'll just, uh, we'll get through this zone and we'll see what's what. It's cool. It's a cool effect. I'm not going to lie. Like, it's a neat effect. I like, I think it looks cool, but it is unfortunately doing some bad things to my eyeballs right now. We got more. I should change. I should change gods. 25% bleed can carry multiple. So that's from uh, my god's favor. But yeah, I should. I should update. Get a new god. Ah. Okay. Thank you. A little bit of shield. Random vending machines. Nice. Let's see what we have here. 5 HP for 1 coin, 3 for a chest, 10 for a random stat up. We don't really have very much. So do we know what's... We don't know where we're supposed to go yet. Can we figure... Can we figure that it's not here? Like, can you see the exits? You can. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Whoop. Stuck there. Stinking Koroks. Okay. They're my new priority for uh, for eyeballs' sake. Yeah, if we kill them fast enough, we don't have to deal with it. Ooh. Wild! We're out of here. Not enough mana? Oh, wait. Oh, we swapped... Uh, there we go. We swap the order. Not a, not a mana for... We do have enough mana for the fireball. What are you talking about? Oh, well. Okay, cool. <laughs> now it fires. I pressed the same key. 
device with three buttons. Let's get some coins and go up to the, um, to this room. The leaf blower is just kind of busted. Boost. Add another mod. Luck-based chance to create two bees on hits. Another mod. Crits give two mana. Upgrade stats, upgrade stats. And then you get the hell out of here. Ricochet. The thing is, like, I could... Here's what these are. Like, you can take a look at them. But I, I'm very much like a... I like to focus in on a specific we weapon in a game like this, because it makes it more fun to come back, and it makes it feel like there's more unique runs when you hyper-focus on one gun. Not to mention this one is obviously kind of bonkers right there. Whoop. All right, go blue. Get the Korok out of here. Oh, there's an the urn man on this floor. I thought he was just like, I thought it was unique to the other floor. Whoop. Yeah, if you don't like long runs, uh, this is not the god for you. <laughs> Wisdom. Crit max energy RNG. Faith experience faster, max health. Sure, sure. My eyes! My beautiful eyes! Okay. Korok. You go. Okay, that's the man that is going to have an urn. What are we, we're at 86 here? Where's the urn? Up there. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. So you have a tw is it a 25% chance to, be to bleed? Is that what we got from that one thing? Um... Purple man. Purple man. Get out of here. Purple man. I will say I, I value my eyes more than purple man. That's the, the tier list of priority that we've got going on. These waves, they don't last any time. We're overpowered. Okay, the boss is going to be up there. We'll do this boss and then we'll... Uh, probably peace for today. <laughs> Though this weapon, like, I don't know, dude. Could probably go forever. If we really wanted, we could, like, actually wait a little bit of time in between these waves, and it would technically be smart. Okay. The fact that I dodged that is, uh... Wild to me. Oh. Dumb. Dumb, 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 dumb. Bloomin', get out of here. Roberman, get out of here. How many waves is this? Is it three? Why does it feel like so many, man? I'm gonna kill the boss. Uh, hello. Do we have enough mana to... Yeah, we do. All right. Yeah, I think I'm too strong. <laughs> I think we're gonna call it here for today. Uh, after it, okay, fine. I'll see what the hell that's about. If it just takes us to like a final boss, then like that's a different story. Like I'll, I'll go do that. Faith up. Unknown. Uh, actually down by thirteen for a bunch of regen rounds. Potion, sure. 10 HP to open. Sure. Bullet Bather. A luck-based lifesteal? I'll take it over this. Sounds kind of nice. Key to open. Sure. Restore a mix of HP and MP. The effect of the last card used. What was the last card I used? I think it was, wasn't that the faith up? I don't remember. Doesn't matter. Alright, what is this? Death. Oh, that's the end of the run. 
Oh, gotcha. Okay. Well, bada bing, bada boom. By defeating, after defeating the beast of evil, you leap heroically into the exit. Okay. I think there's probably, I mean, it's a demo. I forgot, I even forgot it was a demo. It feels so full-fledged. You could play this like it's not a demo. Uh, we got a win there, though. All right, very, very cool. I'm glad that that was where it was going to end because my eyes were about to end. I would say, like, the game already has a flashing light setting. I would say definitely lump that bullet in with it. Uh, that bullet pattern from, like, the Korak guys. Would probably be a good call. As far as other things go, I don't know. It's like the, the, <laughs> the balance of the guns. I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I maybe I got the worst gun imaginable on the first run and the best gun imaginable on this run. Maybe. Maybe my combination was just good. Maybe the god combination was good. I don't know. But, like, it was the difference between enemies dying in a blink of an eye and taking, like, a full minute to kill. So, like, it's kind of crazy just looking at the bosses, for example. Is that fine? Eh, you know, it can be in a roguelike. It certainly can be. But I, I really like this. I think it has a, a lot of promise to it. It's very brutal. Get ready for a tough time. Uh, but I think it could be worth the time for sure. And it's, it's got, like... I don't know, it has that style, that flavor of roguelike, that much more like Isaac Gungeon style of dungeon crawling roguelike that there's like not as many of made as you would think. And it's got the really nice flair of like the, the level of RPG mechanics feeling very tiny rogues in that kind of a way. But then it's got the bullet changing mechanic. It's doing a lot of things that feel familiar, but it's also doing a lot of things that feel new. And it's doing the familiar things in new ways. So I really do recommend this one. I do think, you know, mileage may vary on whether or not you, your eyes can handle it. If it's fine, it's a problem. It's not that bad, but like definitely it's got the setting in there. Uh, you're going to have to definitely... Be ready for a, a challenging experience, and that might even be very pleasurable to you. That might be a huge plus. It might be a detractor. That one is for you to know. Uh, for me, I I like it. I, I really enjoy it. I think it's a good, tough tough time. The weapon trivialized it that I had on the second run, so it's hard to, hard to really say what a, a true situation would look like. Uh, but hey, alas, alas, that's that. That's going to do it here for today. My name is Retromation. You cover any games every single day with an extra specialty in roguelikes and roguelites. If that is something we're into, if you want to find these games before all the other channels, check it out. If you want to figure out, you know, the first place that these games get checked out, this is usually the place. So make sure you subscribe, get notified when cool new stuff like this comes out from under the radar. Uh, thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.